Hello and welcome to Wager on the World Cup. I'm Yue Jun, a sports writer for Free Malaysia today. I'm back after a day's absence and the quarterfinals now upon us. Let's take a look back at some classic World Cup quarterfinals. So, we're going to look at 1966 Portugal versus North Korea. That's right, North Korea actually made a World Cup quarterfinal once. And in this one, they were ahead 3-0 in the first half. 3-0! But spearheaded by four goals by the Portuguese legend Eusebio, Portugal came back from three goals down, won 5-3, and made it to the semi-finals. Now we're going to fast forward over 40 years to 2010, Uruguay against Ghana. In this one, it was tied late on, when a certain goal that would have won it for Ghana was stopped on the line with Luis Suarez, with his hands. Now, because of this, he received a red card, and Asamo Gian had a penalty to win it for Ghana, but missed it. And in an astonishing turn of events, the match went to a penalty shootout, which was eventually won by Uruguay. So because of this, Luis Suarez's handball actually ended up winning Uruguay the game and putting them into the World Cup semi-finals. Okay, let's take a look ahead to tonight's games. Speaking of Uruguay, we have Uruguay against France. Now, this is gonna be a really, really tight one, because Uruguay are the only team to have won four regulation time matches in a row in this World Cup other than Belgium. And now, going up against this France team who will be full of confidence after a tough victory against Argentina, with Kylian Mbappe playing an amazing game. However, Uruguay will be sweating on the fitness of Edinson Cavani. Now Cavani, despite scoring two goals against Portugal, sustained an injury in the game. So. How do I see this going? I think that may be enough to sway it. I'm going with a slight France win. Now we're going to look at Brazil against Belgium. Another match of two possible title contenders, and given other circumstances, could easily have been the final. Now, Brazil knocked out Mexico in the round of 16 with a convincing 2-0 win, while Belgium had to dig deep to fight back from two goals down to take out Japan. However, this Belgium team has shown a ton of finesse and attacking flair and verve throughout this tournament, spearheaded by stars like Lukaku and De Bruyne and Hazard. With Brazil, they're led by the likes of Neymar and Coutinho, but even though they've been playing well, they haven't been on the same level as the Belgian stars in this tournament. And for that reason, given that they car carry on their current form, I'm going with a Belgium win, putting them in the semi-finals. Alright, this has been Wager on the World Cup, signing off.